Hello mga titas! Welcome to Tita Riz TV. In this episode, we'll explore the 13th largest and one of the fastest growing cities in the U.S., the city of Fort Worth, Texas. Fort Worth is known as the cow town because of its deep roots in the cattle ranching industry. In this trip, we get to explore the rich and diverse cultural history of the city. Giddy up and run. Don't miss your chance to skate at the rodeo ring here in the legendary Fort Worth Stock Yard. One of the items in my bucket list is to watch the cattle parade at the Stockyards National Historic District. I was able to check it off in this trip. The Fort Worth Stockyards National Historic District once was home to cowboys, cattlemen, and outlaws. But today, it is one of the most popular attractions in Texas. You get to enjoy the stockyard during the day and at night and definitely got a taste of the true American West. The Fourth Worth Erd is the world's only twice-daily Longhorn Cattle Drive held every day at 11.30 a.m. and 4 p.m. in the Fort Worth Stockyards. The Erd experience with the Texas Longhorns takes approximately 15 minutes. The best place to watch is in front of the Livestock Exchange Building at 131 East Exchange Avenue. Free surface parking is available in the Modern's parking lot near the entrance. In the Stockyards National Historic District, free street parking is offered along East Exchange Avenue. Additional paid parking can be found in paid lots throughout the district. The Exchange Avenue has weathered brick streets lined with historic buildings, restaurants, shops, saloons, and Old West themed entertainment. There are 41 bars and restaurants, 50 shops, and over 17 must-see attractions, all surrounded by the rich history of the Fort Worth Stockyards. For lunch, we dined at the Second Rodeo Brewery. It is a brewery and bar garden with daily live music, good grub, and a large dog-friendly patio in the historic Fort Worth Stockyards. 
This is located at 122 East Exchange Avenue, Suite 340, Fort Worth, Texas 76164. They are open from Mondays through Sundays from 11 a.m. to 12 a.m. If you're into real Texas music, house brewed beer, and delicious grub made with nothing organic, then Second Rodeo Brewing is the right place to be. What I love so much about this place is its unique and playful interior design. Inspired by the outlaw country music renegades and the outlaw cowboys of yesteryear's Texas prison rodeo. This place is perfect for any sports fan. You get to watch your favorite game while waiting for your food to be served. We get to try the Truck Yard's famous Philly cheesesteak made with ribeye steak and provolone and the black garlic barbecue with sweet garlic Texas barbecue sauce. Stockyard Station stores are open 10 a.m. to 7 p.m. Most restaurants are open 11 a.m. to 10 p.m. And most Stockyard saloons are open until 2 a.m. on the weekend. After witnessing the famous cattle drive and trying out the steak, let's now enjoy the nightlife at Stockyards.
I get to meet with Jay's friends. We are meeting them up for dinner at the Tannehills Tavern and Music Hall. Tannehills is owned by Chef Tim Love and is named after his son, Tannehill Love. It is the new premier entertainment venue in Fort Worth, Texas. In the music hall, <laughs> this is where Jay's friend is gonna sing. Okay. Is he singing now? Yeah. We had this trip mid-January, and Christmas decors are still around downtown.
I hope you enjoyed this episode of Peter Travel Adventure. Please like and subscribe.